Hi, welcome to the Arcade Buffet. Today we're going to do a little quick video on how to discharge your monitor. A lot of people are afraid of this and there's no real reason to be. So I want to give a little show on how to do it. If you look over here in this corner, I'll put this up here to see it, you will notice it flash in the background. See the monitor is working. I'm adjusting the focus, the screen knob on the flyback. So we have raster and I have a test pattern generator hooked up to it. So the monitor is running. This is a G07, so you will get a good demonstration of how it works. So, there's no reason to be afraid of it. You don't need some great big long huge screwdriver, you know, with some, you know, horrendous handle on it, whatever. Or, you know, a great big huge wire, whatever, you know, that's 10 feet long and has, you know, 5,000 resistors in it. Now, on a vector monitor, I do recommend a high voltage probe. This is for raster only. Um, but for a raster, all you need, simple, is a little screwdriver. This one's not very long. You know, it's, like I so say, you can see the size of my hand. It is, you know, not a big screwdriver. It's a Craftsman 41053, which is just old cheapy. And just a regular set of alligator clips. Nothing special, you know, Radio Shack special before they, before they went under. So all you got to do is turn your monitor off. We'll do that in a second. Put one clip on your screwdriver and the other to the frame anywhere. It doesn't make a difference. Turn your monitor off. You don't even have to unplug it, but we will just because. So you unplug the monitor from the power, okay, disconnected. And all you gotta do, if you listen, you'll hear a snap. And that's it. It is discharged. That that's all you gotta do. Nothing special. Just run under and it's done. So we'll plug the power back in. We'll turn the tube on to charge it back up. Alright. If you watch in the background, as soon as this warms up, it takes a second. But if you watch in the background, the top right hand corner of the screen, you'll see it getting brighter in the background. See? Monitor's on. Okay. We'll turn it back off. Unplug the power again. And that's it. Didn't have my hand in my pocket. Nothing. So it's not hard to do. Just put it underneath. Touch the anode where the little clips are, and it's discharged. When you're done, remove the anode cap. If you want to again, you can discharge it again. So, like I say, not real hard to do. It's easy, so nothing to be afraid of. Now, when you go to put your chassis back on, make sure you do this again, because the tube will build up another charge. A little bit of one, so discharge it again. Same method, you know, nothing special touch the inside where the hole is, and you're good to go. So, hope this has been helpful, and if you have any questions or comments, please leave them at the bottom of this video, or shoot me an email at thearcadebuffet at gmail.com. So, nice, easy, simple, how to way to discharge your tube. See you soon!